putting. How much of it is just not having competitive reps on your <laughs> I did. Well, I didn't have very good speed early. Uh, had two, uh, two three putts, and um, consequently, in a couple over par. But I didn't hit my irons close enough today. You know, I didn't give myself very good looks. Um, need to do a better job of that going forward. Um, hopefully, get myself back in this tournament. Like feels good. Mm -hmm. How's the like feel? Sure. Can you explain what you felt uh, that last approach by the bunker? Well, well, it. I was trying to hook it more than that and put, probably put it in the left gallery or left bunker, give myself an angle. I didn't do that. Um, but also, then again, then again, try not to hosel rocket over to the right either, because um, that that hosel was sitting there right next to that golf ball. I guess I meant the, the hopping in the bunker. Well, it's on my left leg. I'm good. It looked awkward. Yeah, but hopping on the left leg is fine. If I did it on the other one. Not so fine. How would you grade your round today? Different parts of it, uh, of your game. Well, I feel like I drove it good. Um, I just didn't do the the job I needed to do to get the ball close. Um, today was the opportune time to get the ball, um, get the round under par, and I didn't do that today. Uh, most of the guys are going low today. This is this was the day to do it. Um, hopefully tomorrow I'll be a little bit better, a little bit sharper, and uh, kind of inch my way through it. I mean, this is going to be a an interesting finish to the tournament with the weather coming in. Uh, if I can just kind of hang in there, um, maybe kind of inch my way back, uh, hopefully it'll, it'll be you know positive towards the end. What happened Larry, can second you tell us through on three? Second shot on three? Oh, I, I, I didn't hit it. I hit it kind of uh, high on the face. Um, it, it wasn't a, I was trying to spin it and it came out kind of uh, hopping and with kind of uh, a tumbler. Well, I hit, a, I hit a good drive. Xander and I both hit good drives when we were down there. We were both at, uh, he was at two eight, 219, I was 218 front. Um, but we, we weren't sitting very good um, in the first cut right there. So um, it wasn't really an opportune time to go for it. So we both laid up. Is that what you, sort of the intention that they were looking for to, to have to make you keep driving? Yeah, I mean, if you hit it up more up the left side like, like Victor did, um, even Victor played a, played a cut there. And he get up, I'll get it up the left side and... Um, yeah, you. There's less options off the tee. Obviously, you know, there's no really three wood there, and you just hit driver and maybe turn it just a touch, or you can hit what Victor did. I mean, you can actually cut it off that tee and you have room, and he hit some kind of four or five iron in the green. Are there shots where the pain is, is more focused, or is it just something constant? Like it's constant. Can you talk us through eleven? Yeah, eleven. Uh, um, the wind lied down just a little bit. And I had a good five iron in there, right where I was looking. Uh, we we're trying to, you know, keep it short of that bunker so we have an angle. And the wind just laid down, and it, you know, I missed the spot by what two yards, and it craned off the the edge of the at slope and gave myself, you know, basically no shot. Good, thank you all very much. Appreciate it. All right, thank you guys. Thank you. Appreciate it.